Oh, shit, I'm looking good. Ah, ah, ah. Yo, you lot saying this, let me save you today. We're hitting a little workout. I'm waiting for my boy to come to mine. And we're going to go to the park and just get a little workout in. Hope you're having a beautiful day. Literally, I'm just in my kitchen. I was going to have electrolytes today. I've been taking them. But I'm not going to have it right now. Let me show you the fit. We got the Crocs. Woo! Ah, ah. I'm actually waiting for charms to arrive as well. I'm going to show you lot when they come. It should be coming like on the 21st. And then I got on my... Come on now. Hegemino Ippo jumper. Just grey. And I'm going to wear my black shoes as I always do. So yeah, that's pretty much what I'm on right now. What are you doing right now? Except for sitting down. I didn't work out yesterday. I was supposed to make a YouTube video yesterday. Apologies. Don't get at me. Okay? Shit. I'm trying to be more time efficient. And I'm really struggling to balance out everything I need to do. But I need to just get it done. Today we're going to hit chest and back. So I'm going to take you with me. Today we were trying out a different bar. But this bar was ass. I mean, my grip strength... I, like, my grip was getting so tired on this one and i just think the bar is higher which is better so my muscle ups did feel different and my form and i wanted to start off with muscle ups because i get tired from them so that's why we're not starting off with pull-ups for our back but yeah no nah, after this my hands were hurting and i just couldn't hold on for long so we switched back to the original park now that we're at the normal park I decided, let me get my cardio in now. You know, we already walked there. I don't know if I'll be asked to do cardio at the end of the session. So I was just working on my doubles and I still can't even do a cross yet, which is kind of embarrassing. I'm not going to lie. What do you lot know about skipping backwards though? This is a skill to backside. Now on to the fun bit, muscle ups. I'm actually so glad I can finally do muscle ups. I feel like I've always had the strength. My rep range for pull ups are like what 15, 20 if I'm feeling energized, but most of the time it's like a 16, 17 is is like consistent. You know what I mean? Momentum is key, but when I first tried to do this, I was swinging way too much. I can actually do it with, you know, less swing, but I'm just trying to work on my technique and get more reps in. Not like a muscle-up pro, but if I did have a tip, I would say to not think of it as like a pull-up. Like, you really are trying to get over that bar. You want to try to bring yourself all the way up, and it's like, I think of myself going over it, but still, like, I'm just getting used to it, if you know what I mean. Even on, we just got standard pull-ups. I love these. I feel strong when I do pull-ups now. And I went through a phase where I hated pull-ups. But all you need is pull-ups, push-ups, squats. Yeah? That's solid in its own if you don't have any equipment or anything like that. Obviously, this is a park. But, like, there's definitely a park near you. Or you could just get a pull-up bar or on your door frame. But those exercises will definitely get your body right. I do my pull-ups. I put my chin up to the air like I look up to my ceiling, the clouds, and I literally just retract my scapula as well. And that's how you get good form and you'll see some back growth there. So we're gonna do these for three sets. I don't know if I said this before, but every exercise, three sets till failure. Changed angles here on my third set because I just felt like I was humping the screen, do you know what I mean? And um, we just can't have that. So yeah, here I'm just aiming for good form, control. And I, I was already getting tired, I'm not gonna lie. So I barely did any on this set. Might be a hot take, but inverted rows have been my favourite exercise right now. I'm not going to lie. Above push-ups. I feel strong doing these. That's what I'm saying. When I'm feeling strong on certain movements, I'm drawn to them. But if I do this before I do pull-ups or anything, my back is burnt out. Like These are really good. When I'm going up, so on the eccentric, I'm faster. And I control it on the way down. Obviously, we've been working on back muscles. But this is also amazing for like your biceps and just your arms in general. Alright, 
cool here. I feel like they're about to rip up. Uh, can you see me in the thing? Mm -hmm. I do this, I'm thinking about hey, hey, hey. Oh my god. But no, I do not think of that when I do this. I think about going like right through it. Like I'm pulling myself up and I'm trying to go all the way through. So I want my chest banging. Oh. Like I just want it like rough. Do you know what I mean? So here I was being a bit of a sausage because I brought my resistance bands, right? And I was going to do decline push-ups. But I hit with a reverse grip to get like, ooh, <laughs> that was dirty. I'm leaving that in there. Waist crack was crazy. But to get extra tension on my upper chest, essentially. But the bands, I just did not feel it on the movement going down. So when I was on this, it was good. It was hitting. It was quite challenging because my feet kept sliding off the bar. But you got to do what you got to do, to be honest. You know, look here, bare hands, I'm just one with nature. I mean, come on now. You can't get any more realer than this. If there's a part near you, I highly suggest just hitting some bodyweight exercises. If you're going through anything right now, literally exercise will be a big help. And you just feel great afterwards that like you just need it. This day, I wanted to kill my body. I'm good right now. However, my body just needed it. Like, I need my body to be sore. So I feel like I work hard, you know what I mean? Someone that struggles to be consistent. Just imagine yourself in six months, how great you can be in that amount of time. Which is a good amount of time. I wouldn't say it's a short amount of time. I wouldn't necessarily say it's a long amount of time. However, you just put your head down, you focus on whatever it is and get it done. And you look back at it, you're going to be very proud of yourself. And that's what you need to be doing. Even though you still need some people that are hard on themselves and I'm even guilty of this. But you need to be proud of where you're at now. Because everything's a journey and if you're not loving the journey and you're just looking for it to all end and what's gonna happen next, you're gonna be bored as shit. So I say you enjoy what's going on now, you appreciate the journey and how far you've came and you keep on going to see what comes to you next. When I was doing these I was thinking People probably saw that we fit video and think I can't even do 20 push-ups. I was thinking, damn. But anyway, when I was doing these, I was doing it nice and controlled. This is incline push-ups. These are kind of for your lower chest. Everyone has a better lower chest than upper, but I feel like I still got to hit. I prioritised my upper at the start of this workout, but I'm still going to hit that lower chest. But of course, the upper chest is more stack. But these are great. This is probably what I felt the burn on, mostly. I mean, I was just controlling them push-ups, fully extending. And I don't count reps. I don't care how many reps there are. As long as my body's going to failure, that's all that matters to me nowadays. Give me Who's that? Slow. Yeah, because everyone's saying he looks slow, isn't it?
You know what I mean? But he he's obviously trolling. Yeah, obviously, yeah, because everyone said he looked slow in that video he reposted. Ready? Nah, that looks sus. That looks. white top buddy you just do it in there nah that's kind of ass Shoulders, hit them like razors, boy. And then you can. Nah, nah, the shoulders are always shoulder in there. Good food, good food, good food. What you lot are saying, listen, I'm back home, obviously. It's like late now, it's like 9.32 for me. And you know, I had some goodies. I got back, I was knackered from that workout, absolutely tired. So I'm about to record some boxing videos. I got these bands on, these resistance bands. <laughs> so yeah, and I just got a code for them as well. So I'm gonna leave the link in the description down below. As you know, you know, shadow boxing with resistance bands, highly effective. So yeah, it's gonna be in my link tree. And yeah, I need to talk loudly. I need to get another mic, man. But anyway, if you enjoyed today's video, please like it. Like it if you like it. Or you might not like something even when you like it. You know, like that sometimes when you're on Instagram scrolling, you like it, but you don't really like it. But like my shit now because I need you to like it. Also drop a comment, say whatever you want, and subscribe, do all that good stuff.